Okay, so I have all my wires in place. Running through from top to bottom, we've got the CLK and DT, blue and purple. They are going to be programmed to be the left and right inputs when we turn the encoder. SW is the switch, so this has a little push button. Uh, and then we've got the positive and the ground, orange and black. So as before with the seven segment, I've got my positive going into the five volts. And on the other side, I have my ground. And then I have chosen pins four, five, and six for the remaining ones. Okay, so I've connected my Arduino board to the laptop. I've got power running through, you can see by the lights. And now we're gonna switch over to the Mobi Flight software and start configuring things. So, as before, extras, settings, and Mobi Flight modules. And we are going to add a new device. And this time it's an input device and it's an encoder. Okay, quite simple to configure this. It's asking for two pins, the left and right, and these correspond to the CLK and the DT pins. So in my case, that was six, and that right pin was four. Okay, upload config. Okay, all right. Now, if I now if I can show you, I am going to start turning this right. And I'm getting right detected, and I'm going to turn left. I'm getting left detected, and if I do it quick, it should be. Left fast, there you go, that's what I was trying to achieve. And right fast. And also, I can click the button. But we haven't configured the button yet. We've only done the two pins. So what about that third switch pin? Let's do that now. Okay, so let's go back into extra settings, modules, and we're gonna add another input but this time it's gonna be a simple button. And it just wants the pin. Our SW switch pin was, but there was pin five. I'm gonna set that to pin five. Okay, upload config. And now, hopefully, when I click this, we're now seeing a press and release event fire in. And we've got our left and right. So now if we were to configure this for actually controlling a, a variable in the flight sim, such as the MCP altitude, let's say, we would choose input configs because it's an input device. Double click a row. Let's just call it MCP altitude. Increment and then we'll go to our edit and we're going to go to our module and we're going to choose the encoder and there we go on left action type and then we can choose what we want to happen and we want to control an MCP altitude input got a Boeing 777 altitude increment. That's wrong, it's gonna be decrement. So when we turn the knob left, we wanna turn the altitude, reduce the altitude, so that'll be the deck. And on right, same thing again, we want the MCP altitude Increment INC. Don't ask me why one's in uppercase, one's in lowercase. But there we go. And we say OK. 
and that is it that is now set up